Hey guys, welcome to Algos Explained. This is David, and we are looking at another first look video from Code Wars. And this is a level 8 problem. And by the way, none of these videos are sponsored by Code Wars. I'm just getting started with my channel. I felt that this is a good platform to go off of just because they have a plethora of questions for us to answer. And so if you're new, first look is when I haven't seen the problem before, and so you get to watch me solve it on the fly. You'll get to see me, um, or you'll get to hear my thought process and uh, witness me struggle if that does happen. Level 8 is, I think that's the easiest level. As the numbers go down, they get harder. And so I have other playlists. Uh, go ahead and check them out. Um, I have, like I said, other playlists of different levels. And so let's get started with this one. This one says, keep hydrated. Nathan loves cycling because Nathan knows it is important to stay hydrated. He drinks 0.5 liters of water per hour of cycling. That's good. Um, you get given the time. You, hmm, you are given the time in hours and you need to return the number of liters Nathan will drink rounded to the smallest value. So let's see, rounded to the smallest value. Let's see what that means. If we are, okay, if we ran for three hours, I'm assuming, um, he drinks one liter. And so that should have been 1.5, but it looks like they rounded down no matter what. And so I'm thinking we're probably we're probably gonna use like a math.floor function. Um, when he does 6.7 hours, he drinks three. And so I think the easiest way to check it out is uh, do like a 6.3 or 6.7, sorry, times a 0.5. See what we get. And we get 3.35 and yep, rounded down, that would be a three. So let's check out this also. And rounded, okay, look, they do round down no matter what. So no like rounding up if it's 0.5 or higher. So no matter what it is, they round down. And so let's go ahead. Um, looks like we get a, a number or integer here in time. And so we will return time. And we'll do exactly what we did over here. Time times 0.5 times 0.5. And what we did with this is math.floor, which will pretty much, so if we have that, I'll show you a quick example, math.floor. We will get a five even if it was a 5.9. And the same thing with this, if we had put that in the parentheses of math.floor. And so um, if you wanted to break this down a little bit more, then it would have been like maybe putting it in a variable, let a, uh, total liters equals time times 0.5 and then we could have put in total liters here total liter and that would have been the same thing um, for simple questions like these I like to just if I can return it in one line without making it too complicated I like to do that and so let's go ahead and attempt this question and see what we get cool we passed all 47 tests and uh, we will Submit final. If you enjoyed this one, uh, please like, comment, subscribe, and check out my other videos. Thank you.